Hi everyone and welcome to Protocol 36. Before we get started, over 77% of you guys watching my videos are not subscribed to me. So it would mean a lot if you subscribe as it will help the channel a lot. Thank you. The other day I was watching Black Panther again. As amazing as that film was, it did leave me with one question. That being after Killmonger burned the Garden of the Heart Shaped Herb, I would be lying if I said I didn't wonder if T'Challa will be the last Black Panther. At least the last one to have the, the Black Panther powers. If you don't remember what the Heart Shaped Herb is, millions of years ago when the Vibranium Meteorite struck in the continent of Africa, which its radiation affected the plant life and Wakandan soil including the Hushept Earth. During the Wakandan Civil War, a warrior shaman was given a vision by Bast, leading him to the Hushept Earth, giving him superhuman strength, speed and instincts. Also consuming it, it allowed them to temporarily enter the ancestral plane and communicate with the dead, not only become the first king of Wakanda, but also the first Black Panther. So you can imagine not only is the Hushept Earth also important in the comics, but also vital in the MCU, as it helps to make the Black Panther become efficient and powerful detectors of Wakanda for generations. Unfortunately, the last we've seen of the hardship herb, excluding the one given to T'Challa in his comatose state, Killmonger ordered for the hardship herb to be burnt, so nobody can threaten his role over Wakanda, leaving a devastating effect on the Black Panther legacy. However, this may not be the last time we see of the hardship herb as there is a way to bring the plants back one being the garden of the hardship herb may not be the only place to have a stock of the plants in wakanda and since it grows naturally on wakandan soil which is fused with vibranium as long as those two things exist there is always hope for the mantle of black panther to live on for generations to come in the mcu as the film have only explored a small section of the country, there is probably more hardship herb in the unexplored area in Wakanda. Not to mention there are probably seeds stashed just in case something did happen to the hardship herb. As we know that the royal family and Zuri are and were not stupid. And Zuri's job especially was to make sure that the plants were safe and taken care of. So will T'Challa be the last Black Panther? No, I don't think so. As I believe there is hope for the royal family and T'Challa's future heir. But what do you guys think? Do you think T'Challa really destroyed all of the hardship earth? Or like me, you think there's still hope? Comment down below and let me know. If you enjoyed this, please like and want more subscribe to begin Protocol 36.